Hello, we are going to Chandragiri Hills today. We're on our way to, I think, Tangot. We're gonna take a taxi there, and from there, it's a 30 minutes hike up the hill. Um, and then we buy the tickets to the cable car, and that's what's gonna take us to Chandragiri. So um, I'm gonna take you with me. Let's go. Say hi, Tempo. This is Tempo. She's my little girl, and now she lives with us. Bye. People in Nepal still call these mountains hills because they see like actual mountains like Mount Everest, Annapurna, all these mountains. So these are still considered hills here. I mean, look at it. They're massive. Here we are entering the vicinity. That's where we are. Chandragiri. Chandra. Chandra Giri. <laughs> Thank God we didn't get here any earlier this morning because we just found that the counter over there actually doesn't open for the next 30 minutes. They're not open yet, but we're going up this big ass hill. Let's see if I can zoom it in. All the way up to that cable car. So since the place is not open yet, we decided to come to this cafe, the Fountain Cafe. This is John Nargiri. And there's Patrick and my mother. There's the chocolate ice cream. Vanilla, which actually came exactly how I like it. You'll have to take a few bites. Okay, so we just purchased the tickets and we're on the line now. We paid 3,900 rupees. It was $22 for Patrick. <laughs> and um, they said it's like $15 for Chinese nationals. Yeah, I gotta pay $22, but the Chinese only gotta pay $15. But um, yeah, and then we're going up now. He just said there's this one spot we reach at where your ears just like yeah. <laughs> block and they ha they need to pop so bad that they just don't. I'm ready. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Misty, a little chilly up Misty. here. Hi. Hi. Wild. My mom's loving her photo shoots. Oh my god, it's chilly up here. Do I need to buy a hoodie? Wow, this place is like so chilly. It was like sunny down there. We were like, we need some AC, and now it's so chilly up here. We're like, we need a hoodie. It's so dramatic. Walking up the hill, running out of breath. We're shrouded with the mist. Ah, I have to use the restroom so bad. Hopefully, there's a toilet up there. I was just told we still have a 15 to 20 minute more walk. Hopefully, that's a lie. But yeah. Here's our view today, on a clear day. That's your view from right here. Different range, you can see Mount Everest. Mount Everest, just the tip. The you Shanka can see Mountain. Garik Shanka. <laughs> That's what should be right out there. <laughs> woo woo! Misty day out. Holy cow. Up in the clouds. 
So for us to go up there, that's where the actual temple is that devotees come to worship. You have to take your shoes off. I'm really not looking forward to taking my shoes off, but if I don't, they'll probably kick me out of here. So let's let's do this. Just careful, you're in a puddle, baby. You just stepped in a big puddle. <laughs> There's the bulls, big bulls. Go ahead, babe. Just want to make sure I don't step on the puddle of water. There's the really nice Nepali woodworking. They give you a blessing and they give you some marigold, I think they're called. Yeah. We're in the world of the mist. There's the view tower, you probably can't even see 10 feet out of it. They got a barbecue beer garden. Looks damn good, now I'm all hungry all of a sudden. They got a little playground for all the little kids and some of the grown-ups too, it looks like. I just overheard someone say the place is not even nearly as close to as crowded as it usually gets because of the weather conditions and they said uh, towards winter is when it's more clear and you get a better view of the mountain ranges. Better weather in winter. <laughs> we got horse riding in the vicinity as well. Here you find safe in horse riding. <laughs> riding horse fast. Here's the horses. And this little guy's just munching on something. Looks like he's got some corn. A little amphitheater. There's all the clouds rolling in. Can't see anything. Ominous clouds over there. It looks like it's gonna rain really 